The basic white mat board is a staple in every frame drop around the world. There are lots of different shades of white and some appear to be much brighter than others. But did you know that some of these bright white boards are often achieved using chemical compounds that can be harmful to your artwork? In this video, we'll find out what these chemicals are, how they work, and helpful ways to spot them in your mat board. The shade differences from one white mat board to another are usually achieved in the paper making process by adding different colorants such as red, green, or blue dyes or pigments. These colorants will tint the pulp to the desired shade of white. The brightness of a white mat board, however, is a little more complex. The very white mat boards that most people gravitate to when framing a piece of art are most often achieved using chemical compounds called optical brightening agents, or OBAs. What are optical brighteners? There are many names for optical brightening agents. OBAs, optical brighteners, fluorescents, fluorescent brightening agents, FBAs, or fluorescent whitening agents, FWAs. OBAs are chemical compounds that absorb light rays in the ultraviolet spectrum, which, to the human eye, are virtually invisible. When optical brighteners come into contact with full spectrum light, they absorb the UV component of the spectrum and a chemical reaction takes place. This is known as fluorescence. The result of this is that the absorbed UV light is reflected back to the human eye by the OBAs in the visible spectrum of blue and purple, making the OBA paper or fabrics appear much brighter. In fact, the eye is fooled because the OBAs are able to reflect more light back to the eye than originally struck the surface of the paper. Why are OBAs harmful to your artwork? The issue with OBA compounds and framing is that OBAs and mat boards fade over time and will give the mat board a yellow tint when exposed to both UV light and air. They are also highly reactive with other chemicals and compounds and are not a good choice for preservation framing. As many good framers know, this is not acceptable in both PPFA Class 1, Museum 100% Cotton, or Class 2, conservation mat boards made from high alpha cellulose fiber. Everyday photocopy paper is a great example of OBA-rich paper. Because consumers are looking for the whitest paper they can find, and generally are not using it for archival purposes, office paper is loaded with OBAs to make the paper appear as white and as bright as possible. OBAs can also be found in laundry detergents, safety vests, and even cosmetic products such as nail polishes and eyeliners. Before the use of OBAs, laundry detergents typically included small amounts of blue dye in their formula. This would take away the yellow tint in older clothes and replace it with a blue hue which is a much more pleasant color, tricking your eyes into believing the laundry was brighter. This method is commonly used in the paper industry when OBAs are not being used. The paper mills will often add blue pigments to the white paper to make the paper appear whiter. How can you tell if the mat board you're using contains optical brighteners? Be sure to check marketing materials carefully when determining whether to use a mat board for preservation framing. Although Peterborough clearly identifies our corner samples and specifiers if a Class 2 product contains OBAs, Many mat board manufacturers choose not to disclose this information, and OBAs may appear in Class 2 products without identifiers. To be sure you are not being fooled by companies using misleading conservation or museum labels, we suggest investing in a UV flashlight, which can be purchased for under $20. To test the board, place the board on a table in a dark or dimly lit room. Then, shine the UV light directly onto the mat board. If the board glows light purple under the light, it has been manufactured using optical brighteners and should not be used for any preservation framing projects. If the board remains dark under the UV light, it is considered dead in luminance and contains no OBAs. For more information, visit our website at peterboroughmapboards.com.